handling data. Children in class 2, you have learned simply collecting data by counting. Here I will tell you collecting and representing data by tally marks, pictographs and bar graphs. Let us see how we collect data using the tally marks. Suppose we have a row of 30 boys who like different games cricket, hockey, football, chess and badminton. We go on asking each boy his choice of games and recording the collected information. In such a case we prepare a table containing the available choices. Then for each boy we mark a vertical line called tally mark against his particular choice. Once we have a set of four tally marks for a certain choice, then we indicate the fifth mark by crossing the four tally marks. We then start with a new set of tally marks. Children, when you play snakes and ladders, you can make a table which shows how many times each number appeared facing up. One of such type of table is shown here. Children, when we make use of pictures or symbols to represent information, we call it pictorial representation or pictograph of the given information. Information expressed through pictures is usually clear and is easily understandable. In pictographs, the same type of pictures or symbols are often used to represent a specific number of objects. The quantity that each symbol represents is clearly mentioned in the representation. Take a look at this pictograph. Neha, Varun, Sonu, Rishav and Ravi counted the toys they have. Sometimes one picture can represent more than one object. Now look at the example shown. The given pictograph shows the number of Coke bottles sold in a school canteen from Monday to Friday. Children, we can also represent data in the form of bar graphs. This is a graph with rectangular bars with lengths proportional to the given numerical data that they represented. Here, instead of pictures, bars are drawn. The bar graph shown here lists the number of TV sets sold in a week from a TV showroom. As you can see, it is easy to read a bar graph too. A bar graph must have a title to tell us what it shows, appropriate scales and labels for both the scales.